Metformin is a tool to demonstrate to the FDA that aging can be targeted. Okay, that's the only reason. When we talk with the FDA, we don't talk about metformin. They know everything that we have to do in metformin. TAME is designed to ask, is one drug going to delay a cluster of age-related diseases and mortality? Is taking metformin going to prevent, you get the point for each one of that, heart disease, cancer, cognitive decline, and mortality? Okay, this is a construct. And if it does, it means for us that you interfere with aging, okay? Because that's where we are coming from. Metformin targets all the hallmarks of aging. So we want to show this drug will prevent aging because aging is what uh, causes the diseases, okay? It drives the diseases. So if we interfere with aging, we're going to affect not one, not two, and three diseases together. So it's not, it's not that we're curious to know what's the result. We, we plan TAME and the dose of metformin and the ages of people because we knew that it's going to be successful, but it's for the FDA to understand that aging itself is a target. Before this conversation, I was watching uh, one, of vi one of the videos that Brad uh, made uh, regarding uh metforming and one thing that uh brad uh, said in the video brad correct me if i am wrong but uh you said that the the, the lifespan increase uh in in the trials with met more metforming uh wasn't uh precisely uh a study very uh compelling I think it's important to um, to clarify a couple of things. So the clinical guidelines um, absolutely recommend that we use metformin for type two diabetics and pre diabetics, um, but you know the, the guidelines don't suggest that we should be using metformin for non diabetics, um, and 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 that's because we don't have evidence within that age uh, within that um, population group that metformin will offer benefits for you know cancer, cardiovascular disease, all cause mortality. Um, you know, and, and one of the, the famous trials of that was the Diabetes Prevention Program uh, study that was published in 2021 that involved just over 3,000 people. Uh, that was a randomized controlled trial, and over a 21-year period, there was no difference w between the placebo group versus metformin in all-cause mortality and cancer and cardiovascular disease. So, you know, I, I'm not about to start prescribing metformin to my non-diabetic patients um, until we've got evidence within that um, within that patient population. But for my pre-diabetics and type 2 diabetic patients, you know, every day I'm prescribing metformin for them. So uh, I think it's just important to, to clarify that. And, and that's why I fully support what Nero is trying to do, that if we can, you know, use uh, studies such as the TAME study to actually show that, yes, there is a, a mortality benefit for non-diabetic patients, I think I think that's wonderful. So I, I want to I wanna just uh, comment on that. There, First of all, there are three clinical studies that showed that metformin uh, decreased mortality in the diabetes patients versus control, right? Versus other drugs. Yeah. One was 22% overall mortality, one was 36% uh, overall mortality, and one was 50% mortality. So the evidence that metformin uh, affect mortality is clear. My overall point there is that I don't think there's enough evidence for non-diabetics to be taking metformin. I agree on that, but this is... So this is a very different concept. And I tell you what divides us, Brett. You think, I think of diabetes as an age-related disease. I think the risk for diabetes, to get diabetes, the major risk is aging. Okay, it's much more than obesity. And metformin is a good, good anti-diabetic drugs, but the, the reason that it affects a mortality has nothing to do with the diabetes. Look, we, we, we don't know that for certain though. Like the, the the human studies that have showed a mortality benefit with metformin are in diabetic patients. Right, but I'm saying that the, when you talk about mortality, you talk about aging. <laughs>